Hey guys, and welcome back to today's video. First of all, I want to be super sorry that I didn't upload yesterday. That was mainly because I had such a busy day and I went shopping with my mom and I had such an awesome day. And I really hope you guys had an awesome day too. But now you're probably wondering, why are you on a different account which is only level 10 and only has the horse level 3 and has no other horses or anything like that? This account was made back in the days when I couldn't afford myself Star Rider and I made a lot of accounts to do all the free quests over and over again. And with the code YouTube you can get 200 Star Coins and a few weeks of Star Rider. I think it was 14 days or 15 days, I am not entirely sure but I'll put it down below in the description box. So today I'll be doing some quests with James and this quest is called James Treasure Hunt. So the first thing we need to do is find the person who calls themselves Butler01 on the internet. They live somewhere on Jorvik, the name must be a clue as to who they really are. Okay, so let's go to the winery and go to that butler 01 because I know who that person is because I did these quests back in the days when I was only a level 10 star rider on my main account Isabella Snow app. So I got a problem and the problem is that the butler isn't here and that is because I have done the quest with Alex right over here in which the butler rode away with a car towards there and I am not entirely sure what I should do right now. Uh, maybe I can go to Valdale or to Jarlheim to do some quests over there. I can also do some quests in Silverglade, so yeah, let's do the quests in Silverglade Village. I'm pretty excited to do them, so let's go. So here we are with Donald the Tailor, and I already read this quest, so I don't need to read it again. But we need to talk to the blacksmith, and my home stable is at Moreland, so I can also call for pickup, because I'm just too lazy to write that. So now I'm on my way to the blacksmith and I actually am pretty excited what he has got for us. So I already completed the quest, never mind about that, but now we're gonna do the next one which is called the waiting game. And this quest says that we need to gather firewood and then talk to the blacksmith. So yeah, let's gather some firewood. <laughs> So I successfully gathered all the firewood and now I'm gonna complete the quest with Conrad. So now we need to gather dark your virgin amber from the beach and then talk to the blacksmith. So let's do that too. gathered dark your vegan amber and now I'm gonna complete the quest again and take a look what he has got for us right now and I can't take this quest while on horseback so now I'm gonna climb off my horse and try again so yeah let's go and do this quest I am pretty excited why I needed to mount off and it says assist the blacksmith with the manufacturing of sewing needles so okay let's do this follow the blacksmith's instructions to be able to make new uh, new what I couldn't read that but what do we need to do right now I think we need to Oh, fetch some wood. Okay, fetch some wood. Set the wood on fire. Okay, there we go. Um, go grab my special hammer from the toolbox here behind me. Can you hand me the hammer? Where is it? Well, where is it? I can't... Oh my goodness. Oh, here it is. I couldn't see it. Uh, put the needle in the water bucket. Okay, here we go. Uh, fetch some wood again. Oh my goodness. Keep it on fire. Keep it on fire. Um... Uh, now that the needle has cooled down, you can get it out of the water bucket for me. Okay, and there you go. Here you go. You have the needle right now. Um, so we have done this. I was pretty stressed. But now we need to give the needles to Donald in Silverglade Village. So let's do that and head back to Silverglade Village. So here we are with Donald the tailor and I hope he is happy with his new needles. 
And now we get the clock above his head, so that means we can't do this quest today, but we can do it tomorrow. But I will not wait till tomorrow because today is already Sunday and this video needs to be up today. So I am gonna be going to Fort Pinta and I am gonna unlock Jorvik City. So I wanted to tell you guys about this. This is a pretty easy life hack. Um, the bus thingy is always over here and if you click on it you need to uh, yeah, put your bus ticket on here and then you can go wherever you want to go. So I'm going to go to Yorvik City Mall and this is just a very handy tip if the bus doesn't come very fast enough, like in a minute or something. If, if the bus just came and you missed it, you can go over here and yeah, take the bus over here. So here we are with the janitor and he has got a quest for us and I don't know what I should do right now because I don't really remember the uh, quests of Yorvik City. But now we need to talk to Clementine in the cafe in the mall and I am still not entirely sure if I pronounce her name right but I think Clementine is a very weird name because I don't know it's just such a weird name because it makes me think of oranges and I am not sure why but yeah, there you go, it makes you think of oranges. So let's pick up the chocolate hearts from Clementine in the cafe in the mall and give them to the janitor. So uh, here is one, I saw sprinkles. Okay, here we go, a heartfelt order. Let's give these hearts to the janitor right over there. So here we go, um, okay, so what do we need to do now? Give the chocolate hearts to Iris and Aideen's Plaza. Oh my goodness, janitor, it is not Valentine's Day already, it is not. Oh, let's go to Aideen's Plaza. It's time to explore Yorvik City. Each time you leave the mall or get on a bus outside for Pinsa, the map of Yorvik City is displayed. Every time you are going to travel between two areas, the map will be displayed so you can easily pick the area you want to travel to. You can also travel back to Fort Pinsa via the map. Good luck! Oh, so now we can go to uh, Yorvik City! And I think we just unlocked Aideen's Plaza. Yeah! A new area has been unlocked. New destination, Aideen's Plaza. Let's go there, guys. I have never been there on this account. Jorvik City is still one of the prettiest cities ever in Jorvik. Or on Jorvik, actually, because it's an island. But oh my goodness, I am so happy I finally get to go to Jorvik City with this account, too. Hey, Iris, I got some chocolate hearts for you from the janitor. I hope you're happy with them. So now we need to talk to her again and I am assuming this was everything for Iris from now on. Oh my goodness, a new area has been unlocked, Eurovic City Harbor area and I think that is Governor's Fall. And do we have any other quests over here? Yeah, we have got that quest over there. Oh yeah, look, Governor's Fall has been unlocked. But first let's do the quest with Yvonne. We need to paint over the gravity on the wall beside Yvonne and that is this painting and it actually is pretty cool. Why do we need to paint over this? That's so sad. Okay, let's paint over the gravity and here we go. Oh, it's pretty sad. We need to remove this actually. So there's also this quest with Adam and I already did these quests in my Yorvik City video. If you want to watch that video, it's in the right hand corner. I'm going to do these quests in private ones, but now I'm going to do some other quests on the island of Yorvik. So because I haven't done the quest with this mysterious character in my new Yorvik City quests video, I'm going to do them right now. <laughs> wow, this is a weird angle. <laughs> okay, what do we need to do? We need to talk to the mysterious character. Oh my goodness, what is happening? I can barely remember these quests. Oh, oh my, who's that? Who's that? Okay, there we go. That girl's walking away. I am excited. Who's that? <laughs> uh, a spy story, conditions fulfilled. Okay. So, oh my god, why is the angle so weird whenever I click on a mysterious character? What is happening? Meet the mysterious character down at Pier 13 at night. But it, it's, it's, it's day. It's, it's day. The ma mysterious man jumps over the bushes and runs away. Okay, let's take a bus to Pier 13 right now. Okay, here we are with Double O at Pier 13. Let's click on him and take a look what we need to do for him. He is so mysterious, he is so weird, and I'm so excited what he has got for us, though. 
Accept initiation as secret agent. Oh my goodness, are you gonna be a secret agent? That's so cool. Sneak through double iced cores without being discovered by any dock workers. Is this a workout or what is this? Okay, let's go here and then let's go there and then let's go there. Okay, here we go. We are done with this quest and now we need to do another quest and we are going to follow the suspect and governor's fall and take three pictures without being seen. So double O runs ahead to governor's fall and I am also going to be doing that right now. Oh, this is suspicious. This suspicious girl is the one we need to take three pictures of without being seen, okay? Let's take three pictures without being seen right now. Why is this huge arrow above her head? I don't really get that arrow. <laughs> LMAO, what am I doing? Oh, we need to take a picture. Okay, let's take a picture over here so she doesn't spot us. Bam, there we go, taking pictures. Pictures taken one out of three. Pictures taken two out of three. Okay, so let's take the last picture of this suspicious girl. And I am excited what's gonna happen next. So here we are with double O and I'm so excited what's gonna happen next. Please tell me what I need to do right now. Look for the evidence in the green recycle bins, uh, recycling bins at Governor's Fall. Do we seriously? Oh my goodness, what do we need to, what are we searching for in a recycling bin? Anyways, let's just do this and then take a look what we need to do next because I am excited to do this quest, um, what comes after this one. So I looked for evidence in all the recycling bins and now we have got another quest with double O. So let's talk to him again and I really hope this wasn't the end. No, you have got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. Oh my goodness! It is so sad that the quests are already finished, but this concludes my newbie Let's Play video for today. But I really hope you enjoyed it, don't forget to smash that like button, and if you're new, don't forget to subscribe down below. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I really hope I see you Wednesday with a new update video. Bye guys!